Matt Sampson here with meteorologist John Erdman. John, the 2014 hurricane season outlook has been released by the Weather Channel. What are some of the factors that go into that? It's hard to believe it's that time already to look at the upcoming hurricane season. But yes, a team of meteorologists here at the Weather Channel, led by Dr. Todd Crawford, looks at several factors, including sea surface temperatures and the potential of an El Nino, which is forecast to develop during the summer. That all goes into our seasonal forecast. Let's talk about some of the numbers. Uh, we've got named storms, hurricanes, and major hurricanes. What are the numbers there? That's right. Uh, we're forecasting 11 named storms to form, five of which would be hurricanes, and two of those would be major hurricanes. Now, last year we did not have a single major or category three or stronger hurricane the entire right. season. So if you look at this compared to average, it's slightly below the 30-year average for a season. We should remember, we should temper these, these, uh, this outlook though, right? Well, yeah, that's exactly right. I mean, the problem with these outlooks is that they don't tell you what the U.S. impact is going to be. For instance, if we have a large number of named storms, but they all steer out to sea, there's low impact. But we could have a season with few named storms, but it only takes one or two storms hammering the East Coast, and all of a sudden it looks like a very bad season. Exactly. All it takes is one big storm, and you certainly feel it. All right. Thanks, John. You bet.